All right, you guys. So I would like to do an alternative gameplay run for Until Dawn. Starting a new story will overwrite your current progress and access to the episode menu if unlocked. So I can't make a, a different save file. The butterfly flip. A butterfly flip. A tiny butterfly flapping its wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane weeks from now. Did y'all take some notes from Life is Strange? So the flapping butterfly will lead to a hurricane. That's exactly what happens in Life is Strange. Your actions will shape this shape how the story unfolds. So this game is like Detroit become human in a way. <clears throat> it's similar to Detroit become human. Like when I'm playing a game with good replayability, I will do an alternative run like I did with Life is Strange too. The reason I didn't do for Life is Strange before the storm because I felt there's not that much that changes with your choices. But at least with Life is Strange, you know, you notice it's a lot in Daniel, right? Depending on how you treated him and taught him. So I think it changes up and makes it interesting. But I feel like for the first two Life is Strange games, not that much playability. Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Because I was ass at this, and I got like five of them oh, killed, so I want to try to do better. It. it is not her fault that she has a huge crush on him. Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, and just because the game looks really dark, though. To um, okay. maybe I need to lighten it up. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. Um, I'm gonna try to light it up. Turning up the brightness. Cause this game is dark. Hannah! <laughs> oh yeah, I changed my tape. <laughs> I'd rather just fix it in my editor. That'll be better. Mike? Just to fix it in my editor. It's Hannah. Or do we need to turn the brightness up on hey, my Hannah. computer? Oh my god, I'm scared. Hey, did you see that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. I'm gonna change the controls too. Okay, that's better. I turned the brightness up. Considering this game is dark and I need to be able to see. This game will like it's eight hours, so when I complete it in one sitting, we'll never know. Now, I was thinking about just recording in one sitting. Like, like I won't be like, all right, you guys, that's it for this video. Okay. You know how I normally end my videos. So, I was thinking just to just a straight record. And then cut it off at the spot that I want to. Like, if I want to break it up in each episode, like by each chapter, then all I got to do is, just, you know, cut it off in my when I'm editing or something. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, but instead of being instead of ending the video like I normally do. I usually do that on Twitch. Split the video. I know I was doing a lot of screaming when I recorded this. I had used Streamlabs OBS because when I opened up OBS, I got an error. So I just opened up Streamlabs and I installed I added a compressor filter that keeps my audio from peaking. AKA blowing out your eardrums if you wear headphones. So it did kind of make it feel like the screen was muffled, but 
Okay, we already tried to open that door. I wish they would deselect what you didn't use. Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Ugh. Intervention time. Mm -hmm. Jeez, Josh. We're all Once passed again, out. Mother, oh, no. You've outdone us oh. all. Yeah, I do apologize if the game was so dark um, in my first run. Yeah, I like how I do. If somebody comments on it, I'll go in and adjust it. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my God, she's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my God. Matt, what are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, it's all got out of hand, Just but... a stupid prank. Uh, oh, damn. You guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! <gasps> so do we run after her? Take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We were just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You Usually I put jerks. alternative gameplay. Hannah. On like when I do Hannah. my playlist, I put like alternative so, gameplay. Main gameplay her? alternative. You know, I kinda think you're the last So the just to, to right now, break Mike. up the confusion for the audience. Oh, maybe shit. if I pick traditional, maybe a um controls me as time. I gotta hold it. <laughs> yeah, I might not remember every choice I made another one. Okay, there could be a hurricane in this game if I make the many bad choices or something. This game is in Canada. Does Canada have hurricanes? I think. Isn't this game in Canada? Canada doesn't have hurricanes. Don't think. Oh my good gravy. God. Ooh. Oh. 
this is like these totems kind of see the future right they let you see into the future or something like that Flamethrower guy. Anna. Anna. Hello. Anna. Oh my God, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Anna, is that? Yeah, hey, someone's stalking us. Who is it? Actually, whatever is chasing them is more important, like running from whatever chasing them is more important. No! No! Shit! No! Get back! Fuck! Get back! No! Ah! So what if I let go of the other one? No! Yeah, they just all turn around. Hold on! It was like whoever that is, they have a flame. Hold on! Oh, the branch. Ah! They died no matter what. Oh, Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. Yeah, I think the game's length does depend on your choices. It's kind of like the trip become I human. To help you see it through. And clearly, what me getting everybody, so many people sometimes, killed, made my main play through shorter. Sometimes can be a little scary even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I think when it says don't move, I'm going to cheat and put the controller on the table in front of me. <laughs> or my lap. I see. So which word would best describe how you feel about darkness? Well, winter nights are cold and dark. Depression, feelings of loneliness are not uncommon. This night in which your game takes place is particularly cold and dark. I would think that you might feel 
isolated at times. Does that bother you? Well, not How does he even know what the guy is saying? Person, are we? Well, it seems we have uncovered a significant topic to explore in our next session, but for now, we're out of time. Have fun on your own. Until then. <sighs> Mm. <clears throat> I want to try to play better. Maybe I'll have more gameplay if I'm not stupid this time. I got Josh. Oh, wait, I got Matt, Emily, Chris, and the guy that was with Chris. Kill. Because I'm dumb. XQTE. Yeah, and I don't know why I'm trying to start breaking this down. I'll turn it up. And look around. I'll do multiple plays of the game the depending on the replayability, you know. Full tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. This is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Anthony. With all the Washingtons tonight, oh, yes, on, Josh, oh. on this, the anniversary of the mysterious I know the game came out in, what, 2015? Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I got to say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. So this so, trip is basically um, let just let you know, uh, let's take a moment like a traditional trip that they take. Address the this is basically, you know, it's, it's a traditional a trip. I know you're all probably I'm worried about me. And I know it's going to be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year. But I just want you all to know, um, it means, yeah, it means so much to me that we're doing this. And that I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. And I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! <laughs> and it will be a trip we won't forget. Oh, there's more.
We're going back to the cabin where the tragedy tragedy happened. I'm gonna steal the last screen that Holly knew I played before. That's Sam. And his best friend. Maybe if I do safe, then that would decrease the chance of me dying. You know? See? Trying to get better at QTEs. I need full concentration whenever I get these sequences. Full concentration. Like, full concentration. I saw I got a hollow over the mic. Because I couldn't move, so that means I couldn't, you know, pause the recorder. So, yeah, sorry about that. In this game. Indigenous people and butterfly prophecies. Okay. Alright. How the butterfly indicated the nature? Black is death. Red is danger. Brown is loss. Yellow is guidance. We have yellow. Okay, okay. The totems have the little butterfly thing on there. The so black is death, red is danger. I think those are the most important ones. Remember, black being death and red being danger. Chris, you here? The bag's here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Chris, 
Sam, hey, you made it. Chris has a question on Ashley. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. That's a date. I was eating that. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of the ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right. Here goes. Yeah. <clears throat> this game is like the trip become human, definitely. What are you serious? Don't like I'm time. Wow, nice shooting tips. All right, I'm, I'm cool. bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of. I'm a sharpshoot. Nah, I don't think so, girl. I'm a quick shot. Well, anybody and their brother can shoot a bottle Watch that out. big, that close. I like shooter games. I know some people find those polarizing because it could motivate you to use a real gun. Like, I'm not that stupid. To try, like, what I would on a toy gun on a real one. Like, I'm not, I'm not that dumb. Right, I mean, not I... Sacked. I'm not letting kids play with the water guns because it might... Wait, I'm gonna play with the real one. I'm like, come on, Chris, the cable car. And again, teach folks that a gun, a real one, is not a toy. And they don't try what they see on real stuff like that. <clears throat> but I wouldn't like. I would try what I do on a toy on something like legit that could hurt somebody. You know what I'm saying? Oh man, look at this. Nice. Think we'll get a visit from America's Most Wanted? Looks like someone thought so. Oh, come on. It's pretty abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Having a pizza. I was controlling the girl, and I'm controlling him. Everybody except Chris, I got killed at Wendigo. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. No, everybody except yeah, I swear, Matt, I got killed at a Wendigo. All came flooding back. Year goes fast. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. After you. Oh, real gentleman. was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm trying to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain. Pizza.
Man, I was just trying to look around. And I'll leave that in. So the audience sees how important it is. Because I know I got... I know the Wendigo killed Josh and my other one. Finally, you coming? I posted about it on the yeah, subreddit. Well, I was going to stay here. And somebody scenes, replied. But... Okay. You have to look at the diary for Josh to know that the Wendigo is. Yeah. We can just like people die and reanimate as windows. Just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah. No, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, and I'm kind of worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed, but the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh, that's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like years early and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off the training bra? I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Butterfly effect. Yeah, Life is Strange came out in 2015. This game came out in 2015. As well as Life is Strange. I don't know which game came out first. But I mean, this game came out first. Oh, man, this game don't boy, ask. Boy, oh, boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. I feel like your twists don't really matter in the first Life is Strange. Because you can just rewind and change the outcome. With the exception of... Chase. What the hell? Jess! Hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are but you guys having a really weird stroke? I feel like my twist really matter thing. if can I can Can you please rewind. let us out? Pretty please? Hey, man. I mean, you can rewind, but once you leave that area, you can't, but yeah. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I think your, your choice is matter baiting before oh the storm since you can't rewind. Oh my rewind. god. I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look. I got a lot of meat on my bones. I mean, your choices dictate so how people think about you. Here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. And I mean, it doesn't make or break hey. your gameplay, is what I'm saying. Well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Give that back, you tool. Tool and die. That's my motto. Oh, you're such an idiot. Maybe nosy Nancy shouldn't go nosing around in other people's nostrils. Uh, yeah, I, I try not to do that as a rule. Come on, Jess, you can tell us. We totally keep secrets. Whatever. You'll figure it out eventually. All right, all right, let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh -huh. This game isn't in Canada, it's somewhere in North. <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop <clears throat> and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Emily Mike back. 
I don't think it would have been like as pretty. Nah. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Washington Logic Room. <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, uh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Ah! Oh, oh, Jesus! <laughs> Where did he come from? <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't wanna make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my God, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back on the trip. All right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya. Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, just all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. All right, fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. All right, we got Ashley. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly and not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. He just popped right up in there. Just you. Louise, well, Matt. Well, I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh, oh my god. Hey, well, man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it, Let me check it out. Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead, knock yourself out, I guess. Oh, son of a bitch. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. God I... damn it. Matt.
What are we waiting on? You did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. I'm surprised you could see it up. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? <clears throat> oh, sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> Sing! Crap. Gotta try harder than that, hero. <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Oh, ah! Oh, hey! Oh, snap! Man. Oh, there's a bird. <laughs> Hello? Come on. <laughs> hey, Mike! Boom! Boom Oh, you got me. I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> doing you can't nothing. Hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. I hit the bird. What did it do? Whoa! Ow! Ah. Oh. And then what? Oh, ho. no more. Oh, oh yeah, oh more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> oh, <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done. City. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right. All right. My my. So are we calling it my favor then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica, the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Just remember, I'm not gonna, no, you know, I'm not gonna wow. remember every choice I made. Buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah, it's so nice out here though. Pretty breath. Taking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just <laughs> making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Yeah, it seems like after every chapter, we're back talking Hello to the doctor. again. And how are we feeling? Hmm? <coughs> I've felt that we made some good progress in the last session. But I'm grown concerned about your situation. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. As an autistic person, we want to say crowds. Okay. I guess what I pick here determines things, right?
I'm first. I'm scared of a little cockroach. Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. I didn't do needles, because, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I'm scared of needles in real life. It's just they hurt, you know, and the anticipation kind of makes you anxious. This has storms depending on the type of storm, like if it's a major storm. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Spiders, zombies, and needles. <laughs> That's some combination. It sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. Everything on hotel done. <clears throat> It. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. No! Shut up! First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every yeah. time I climb it. Oh yeah? That feels the same to me. Yeah. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it's so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, we get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Mm. Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? 
Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like get open or something. <clears throat> you are you saying anything, but... we should break in? Look. I don't think it's technically. I mean, what I have to do is make the episodes right? longer. Hey. Cause like if the uh, series starts to clock, making the episodes um, longer, <laughs> lead the you, way, you get coaches. it over with quicker. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. <clears throat> you doing all right? Yeah. Aside from being kind of cold and vaguely creeped out by this place. It's, it's kind of weird being back up here, huh? Yeah. Yes, I started playing God over right? I'm like, mm, that kid's gonna be saving my butt a lot. She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that Parker right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Hey, cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not gonna bang her, maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off her? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. I don't know, man. How can you not know? What if it's like weird? And what if she, she might like want to be friends with me anymore if I try something like that? I mean, weren't you just listening? You gotta buck up, bro. Grow up here. <sighs> so, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. I have to you control. Got yeah, ladies uh, with the exception of Mad, I got everybody I killed at Wendigo's. I mean, the people that I got killed, I mean, oh, with the exception of Mad, ones. I got everybody killed. By We got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. We gotta go in this because the door don't work. Oh, I'm okay. Should have paid more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Oh. Did I do that? It wasn't I don't, me. I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what, what is it? Okay, so 
I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray it's on the can. Know. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the Lormy dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Hey, what does this one say? Lost totem. <laughs> So this is like predicting. So this is so looking at these totems is like predicting and I have to prevent it. This is haunted. No, they're freezing. Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know what they freezing? <laughs> Shouldn't you be like getting the lock open or something? On it. <clears throat> See your prom. We have to check all these doors and find the bathroom. We gotta find the bathroom and look for the deodorant. It's gonna take me some time because it's really dark. I don't even think it's on this floor to be honest. Buns off out here. Ah. 
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. Good <laughs> <laughs> ah. the raccoon. I don't know how long he's been in there. Yeah. <laughs> what was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire to go. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. Will do. Yeah, come on in. Take a load off, have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa, easy there, cowboy. Mm-hmm. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M with the telescope. Before? We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? Um, right. <coughs> right, I'm sure it's all it was. Yeah, let's not you write down my choices. It'd be impossible to keep you up, want. you know? Uh, sometimes I think it's best just to mix yourself, it up. Mike. That is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Yeah. I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's <clears throat> bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah. This game is like a movie. Big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats. Yeah, this channel is for games like that. calling Miss Homecoming a cow. Shut up, Matt. Stay out of it, you dumb okay. Hey, watch it. Oh, you're the only one who could put him down? No one else can play with your toys? You're such a bitch. Whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. On a roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Emily, stop. This is out of hand. There's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. Okay, if we can't get along for 10 minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah, yeah, all right. You wanna go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. <sighs> Glad that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on because the trail. Because I gotta go look for a bag. Matt, are you are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, Do I... you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Oh, 
Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. <sighs> Exile. Oh, the sandwich worked for bath. Sexile. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, far. How far yeah, is this game is like cabin Detroit. anyway? This cabin Become human. Is the coziest, so it seems like each character has their own story, per se. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. You're gonna need these. Porn star? I'd pay to see it. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. <coughs> this whole game is Josh dark. was flirting with me. Okay. You want to I mean, dark us? like... Wait, really? What? Like, outside. Oh. Like, I mean, you know... If she was yelling at me to fire up the generator, that was funny. She said, unless I want to make out with a snowman, I better turn on the heat. That was funny. Unless I want to make out with a snowman or something in my other run, that was funny. Yeah, no, basically, so, um, this run is going to have spoilers because I'm going to recall what happened in my main run. So if you have never seen this game before, hot lips. Photo booth. I suggest All you play right, my, my blind mind. run. I think I'm going to do that when I do the end cards. Okay. I'm like, make sure you watch this gameplay first. You know. Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy and maybe I'll let you start my port. Basically for any game that has good replay replayability cabin. enough for an alternative playthrough, I will no. always iterate that. Watch this gameplay, you know, if you have it. Because this this is blind. I don't know anything about it. If, like if you don't want spoilers. Because some, cause some people are unforgiving if you accidentally spoil something. People are unforgiving i swear to be uh, something i can help you with so that's why i'm gonna be like gonna do that? blind playthrough uh, makes sure you watch the blind mind. playthrough if you've never seen the game you don't want sport like you just want to experience everything firsthand make sure you watch that blind run because i know detroit become human has good playability this game does beyond two souls i'm gonna try heavy rain i might record that after this i don't know i want to try heavy rain so basically, if I, like I said, if I'm playing a game with good replayability, I'll do an alternative huh. playthrough. I'll either record it or stream it. Didn't if I don't Josh know, if, what I do is if I don't know if the game has copyrighted music, I'll do a let's play. The only thing with Twitch is they mute the spot in the VOD. Everything will be muted. So that means I'll have to like re-record. That means you can't hear what the game is saying. But on YouTube, you just can't monetize. All right. Let's see. Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Woo! You are a wizard. This game has a lot of spooky segments. You gotta really be on your toes. Oh! Someone's stalking us. Totally. Danger. So it's like if I just pick up the totems, then it'll I can kind of anticipate what to expect, and I have to be on my guard. Okay. That's all I have to do. You just pay attention to the totems that I pick up, and I pick Zam. better controls. The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That was just awesome. Oh, yeah. 
I bring the hit. <laughs> Psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. Yeah, I think I should do that. Uh, I'm. Whenever I'm linking a specific, like I upload this video, I should just link the playlist. Be like, catch up on the series, binge watch the series, or something like this. I'm Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. It's all such a blur. I can barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half-baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean, it's not our fault they ran into the woods. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? It's kind of funny if you walk around for enough, she'll yell at you to turn on the generator. What was that? Um, Guys? You hear that? What was that? Something. Yeah. Mom, mom, come pick me up. I'm scared. Come pick me up. Damn. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka wax museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. Ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep. Hey. Um, okay. Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... Uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. All right, Jess, there's a cart. I think if you can push it, you can get by. All right. Okay, let me just try. It's too heavy. All right, try it again. It's super heavy. But maybe you already loosened it a bit. I'm probably locked in fight. Hey, I'm like pretty ripped at all, but I don't think I can move it. Any other bright ideas? Hey, so babe, you see the little gap down there? Between the cart and the wall? The tiny little gap? Yeah, maybe you can just, you know, like shimmy through it or something. <laughs> I appreciate your confidence in my physique, but I don't think the ladies are gonna fit. Oh, with the, right. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, so why don't you either toss that light down or, you know, be a hero and jump down here to assist me? All right. Jess, okay, that's gonna have consequences. Drop the light down. Yeah, I'm, trying, I'm thinking about okay. Life is Strange for a minute. What? Look up. All right. Just, eh? We can check the uh, butterfly status, though. It's up. You get it? Yeah, yeah, I got it. <sighs> Something moved. Okay, it's probably just like a bat or something. A bat? 
All right, coming after you. Just stay put. My God, you have rabies. Well, it's not gonna bite you. Okay, that's what bats do. They bite me. Bats have rabies. What other animals have rabies? We got squirrels, we got bats, and dogs. Uh, well, hello. Dogs have rabies, but they but you have to Shall take we? your dog to get get a vaccination. So if he bites somebody, then they won't catch anything. Somebody moved that thing. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. I'm fine. Oh, I think this series would pop up. Oh, God, for... you totally ate. I don't know. Maybe I should have played Thank this you. game for spooky season. We'll never know. Still got my teeth. That's a plus. <sighs> yes. What is it? A rat? Yes. <sighs> I have Nelly. to control Matt. I mean, no, with. Chris. I'm not the good kind of willies. I gotta learn everybody's Your name. Comfort and reassurance. <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster. Yeah, basically, if I pay attention to the totems, maybe that's why I got Josh killed in my game. Like, maybe I missed a totem because I guess the totem is like a way to warn them on what might happen. And plus, that sign told you about the totems earlier in the game. Yeah, I'm, I'm just I'm gonna spend a lot of time looking around. It's paramount in this game, especially if this game is just like Detroit become human. Yep, yeah, it's especially important we look around. I'm saying for people who underestimate how important it is, I'm showing I can I can just show you just by my mistake. That's what I'm saying. Maybe I'll make each episode 90 minutes or so for this game. Yeah, I'll make each episode 90 minutes. This is, right. Like I said, I do this if the series starts to flop. At least I get it out of the way much quicker. I don't be on the game as long making the episodes longer, that, if that makes sense. I should start doing cliffhangers to, to kind of encourage people to be, to stay tuned for the next episode. Jesus, this place is a real fixer upper. Let's see if I can play the whole game in one night. We'll see. I kind of binge record because it kind of helps me. I mean, I, I would just like to do schedules like Tuesday, I'll do this game, Thursday, I'll do this game, Friday, I'll do this game. Finally. I'd rather just upload whatever's ready. Because let's say I pick a specific day for The Walking Dead, let's say, and I get sidetracked with something else, like my blog, and I forget to like edit a video and say I have Beyond Two Souls ready, I'd rather just upload what I have ready than to kind of rush and get a video up, if that makes sense. Thank God she knew I wasn't following her. So they're not really NPCs since we play as all of them at some point. Well, well. Maybe we can do better. Maybe I'll do better at the Wendigos if I try to learn my QTE. I don't know. I mean, I'm trying to learn this game. So people die, they reanimate as Wendigos. Is that what it is? Take a ride on Air Force One. 
So this game kind of like The Walking Dead, but people reanimate into a Wendigo instead of a zombie. Someone at the cabin. Okay. Let me see. Holy! I played the game before and I'm still shitting my pants. Make sure y'all use the bathroom before y'all play this game. This will sure make you shit yourself or whatever. Yeah, bird scared me. Rat wings? Oh, what is it, a rat? The little birdie get your panties on One time I was raging God. hard when I was playing Delta Room Chapter shit. 2. I was at the Giga Queen fight. I raged hard. And then my mom was like, what's wrong with you? I said, I can't pass this part in this game. And she said, I thought you saw a rat. I said I would scream much louder if I saw a rat. I would have been running and hollering if I saw a rat. God damn it, Josh. Couldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. Oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You got something on your face. Ah. Boo! Okay. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? Ah. Yes! Yeah. Damn, that scared me. Nami! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Sam wants her bath. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy are. What is that, a rat? <laughs> Come on. All right, Josh, Just want to take her bath in the war in the, the war in the heat. Big fancy lodge. Sometimes if I just merely go on the right spot, I don't fall for any traps. And I don't know that I, if I, I don't remember if I picked that up in my main run or not. Maybe not. Happy Christmas.
Exploring is important. Oh, wow. Can't be any more about Mike. Compatibility. Remember, I kept calling him the clown Pennywise. Hey, whose room is this? It looks nice. I want to stay at a cabin like this for a nice little getaway. But after playing this game, I'm bringing a whole arsenal with me. And again, it's just a game. So the clown mask reminded me of Pennywise for some weird reason. You know the movie It with Pennywise, the clown? Maybe we could do 90 minute episodes each. Right. I mean, these long yeah, you know episodes, what? it just helps you get through, through the game quicker. What? Especially okay. if you don't know well, how if you're going to upload that particular game, at least the viewer feels like they get more out of it. <clears throat> now, I do put up some short videos from time to time. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, fun, right? If that's what Those the viewer wants. Joke, man. Do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and. Well, Josh, no hot water's kind of major Let's do rage montages, yeah. but I'd rather rate yeah, until I finish the series. Fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um Okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean you're not going to regret it. You up for a ride along? how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. And I just wish Chris would go for it. He's so paralyzed thinking she's gonna shoot him down. It's not gonna happen. Which thing? Well, neither if he doesn't go for it, which knowing Chris, he won't unless someone's holding a gun to his head. <laughs> All right, that's... All right. I definitely want to, okay, for games that have a lot of replayability, like this game, Beyond Two Souls, I'm going to check out Heavy Rain at some point. I will do an alternative run. But if there doesn't seem to be much replayability, then I won't do an alternative gameplay. But that doesn't mean I won't pick the game up in the future should the devs make like a DLC or a spinoff series or whatever. Like, for example, at least like for to me, Life is Strange, Life is Strange Before the Storm. Doesn't seem like it has too much replayability. Mine is like a minor dialogue change depending on your choices, you know, and further along versus the sequel that everybody hated. I feel like it has some good replayability, right? You know, I'm I'm just implying when like Life is Strange Remastered was coming out, I did a stream of the um first four games that came out. So I'm saying if the game doesn't have good replayability. I won't do an alternative run, but that won't mean I won't pick the game up just for the sake if I wanted to stream a good marathon or if a DLC or whatever is coming out and then just randomly choose my choices. That's what I mean. You gotta subscribe, comment, like, share the video with a friend, and I'll catch you.